Hello, and welcome to week five of Pick'em. My name is Aaron, uh, and if you were lucky enough to watch last week's show, you learned two things. One, I recently developed a bit of a drinking problem. <laughs> Shut up, people that know me outside of the show! And two, we have a special treat in line for you. Again, if you watched last week's show, you already know what it is. So I'd like to introduce my co-host, Lamar Williams. Let's give it up for Lamar. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. Yeah. yeah. Have a seat, Lamar. God, you look good. How you feeling? Words cannot describe the way I feel right now. <laughs> I think that's pretty fair at this point. Okay, uh, before we get to uh, before we get to uh, this week's picks, let's check her out. Let's check out what happened uh, last week. Um, last week, so actually it went pretty good. Uh, the drinking is mostly because of my fantasy football teams. Uh, and not because of this, because we both went three and one last week. Pretty proud of that. Uh, we went, we split on the challenge games. Uh, so Lamar defeated me as the Fighting Irish playing against the Shoelace team, and that I'm I'm fine with it. I'll take that loss. I'll take it anytime because the important game here was Forest State versus Clemson, which. Uh, thanks to Julie, we had a uh, a gentleman's agreement that that uh, whew, that the loser would have to wear a dress and drag, and you're seeing that right now. Julie, we'll kick your ass. Pause for effect. Okay, uh, that takes our uh, respective um, respective records on the picks to fifteen and seven, and twelve and ten. All right. Uh, so, first game that we're picking that we have highlighted is uh, Nebraska hosting Wisconsin. Tell us who you got, Lucy. Why looking like that? It's hard not to. Well, despite the dress. I know football. Football's played best in Nebraska. Bo Pelini's defense is all right with me. Love it. Love it. Uh, I can't disagree with that. Cannot disagree with that at all. I'm going to Nebraska also. <clears throat> Ugh. Okay, next game. That's disgusting. Uh, it is what it is. I'm, I'm sorry. I forgot I was in the presence of a lady. Excuse me. Uh, next game we're picking is going to be... Uh, Arizona versus Oregon State. All right, Leslie, what you got under that dress? A wildcat or a beaver? Something you ain't got. But I'm picking the beavers. Because Arizona stuck it up against Oregon, the Ducks. So this time get beat by another Oregon team, the beavers. I dig it. We're all going beavers in this room. Okay, next game on the docket, we've got, this isn't even a docket, but we've got Michigan State hosting the Ohio States, the, the Ohio State University. Leslie? Sport is back. Michigan State all the way. Ground and pound. Oh, I don't know. I'm going to Ohio State. I, Why? Because of Urban Meyer. He don't have Tim Tebow. He doesn't need Tim Tebow. He's got Braxton Miller. Who is Braxton Miller? Uh, only the uh, gentleman who plays quarterback for the Ohio State Buckeyes that this very week, that very coach with the very name of Urban Meyer said was very much better than Tim Tebow. He said, what? Oh, shit. Uh, okay, I, I can't dispute that. I can't disagree with you on that because it's Tim stupid. Tim Tebow, 
Yeah, it, I'm not. No, I'm not disagreeing with you. I'm just saying what he said because Herschel Walker, Tim Tebow, like two maybe two best college football play, right. players of all time. I, I'm going to Ohio State either way. So. Well, buddy, that's a challenge game, buddy. You got one of your wig hairs on me. That's, that's kind of what I figured. Okay, so uh, we're gonna go ahead and play this one out. Uh, me, Ohio State, and Lamar, Mich is that Michigan State? Yes. Let's meet on the, the field. Ohio State, Michigan State. Let's get her started. Lamar is going to run. He's going to juke, and that looks pretty good. Lamar is going to run to the left side. He's going to roll a long way this time. And that's embarrassing. And fat man through a little hole. And then I uh, screen pass no good. That's all I did. I ran one play. Lamar can throw the ball too. Yay, look at Lamar go. And he threw it again, and that was good too. Yay, Lamar. Yay, Lamar. Doing what you're supposed to do. Throw me the ball. Yay, me. I throw me the ball. Yay, me again. Look at that. Not so bad, huh? Uh-oh. Oh. Oh. Lamar's standing still. Get him. Ah-ha. Uh -huh. Losing. And screen pass. No good. His pass was good. Running around, running around. And there's a first down and running around. No first down. Throwing the ball. No first down. Uh, running the ball. That's a first down. At this point, I'm pretty much phoning it in. And there's another touchdown, and someone's proud of themselves. And here we go, wide open. Nope, not wide open. There's four guys there. That's quadruple coverage. You don't throw that ball. Ugh. That wasn't pretty. I need more no-no juice. Yeah, not that one. Yeah, that one. Yeah. Wait, you need my cup. Okay. We're gonna pick for the next game. And the next game that we have circled with a highlighter is Washington Huskies versus Stanford Tree. <sighs> Queen Latifah, who's winning that game? I like Cardinal. It's one of my favorite colors. Stand for Cardinals. You see that? Literally, literally on the label, Cardinal. It's incredible that that worked out that way. Uh, I'm not picking against the Cardinals. The Cardinal. Ooh, we're gonna get letters. By the way, right into this show. Uh, yeah, so both pick and Stanford. So uh, we, uh, we got one more game to pick. We have one more game to pick, and that is uh, it's an SEC matchup. It is between the Georgia Bulldogs and the Tennessee Volunteers. Who wins, Uga or the, the Volunteers? <laughs> Can you see my eyes? Barely. Good. <laughs> Why'd you jump? It's okay. It's okay. Daddy's got you. Daddy's got you. Who wins? Oh, wow. That caught me a little off guard there. But, um, the Bulldogs, because they're going to pound some volunteers in the ground. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, you just you just can't throw around words like pound when you're dressed like you are. Okay, I'm picking Georgia anyway. That's awesome. Okay.
And now is the time of the show where we do a quick recap of our picks. Let me throw our paper and pen on the floor because the magical computer will do the rest. All right, let's get to the mailbag. All right, we got three questions this week. Uh, we're going to go rapid fire this week because Lamar is in a dress and a wig and he's very hot and we feel sorry for him and we love him. First question. I've never been much of a fan of football. I'm from New York, but living here in Alabama, ouch, uh, feels like I should make an effort. Who should I pull for? I guess he's looking for uh, a team in Alabama to pull for. That's from Simon Gold, Gold Goldberg's team. Wow. None. Simon, none. None. Go play table tennis. Uh, that's that's pretty good option. I'm gonna go UAB because I think dragons are awesome. Next question. Uh, <laughs> uh, this is a Twitter question and from uh, at Booty Plop. Hey guys, so my girlfriend turned off the TV in the third quarter of the Florida State Clemson game. What did I miss? Only about fifty points being scored. Damn. Next question. Guys, when I play NCAA 2013 with my friends, we like to throw two picks a game tops. Are we doing something wrong? This is from a jackass. No, you're not doing anything wrong. You're just not having fun playing the game. That does it for our show. What do you think? Man, what is not fair now? I need you. We need you to write back this, into the show. This damn cougar got me. Buzz. By the way, Julie, from the bottom of our hearts, we'd just like to thank you for what's happened here today. Without um, you, none of this would be possible. There's, and don't there's literally only one person in the studio that's upset right now. Get a 